what's going on y'all it is four what time is it let me check the time it's 4:42. voice control 4:42 a.m in the morning and we are here we are here at the gym and we're ready to go uh i started lifting at four around this time now just so i can have more time oh my gosh so i can have more time to uh you know have time at night uh prep my meals cook for other people you know with the business and stuff so everything's been working out uh you know like they always say uh when people say they don't have time they have time you just got to make time for what you want so uh i'm here and i'm about to hit a back uh back and bicep workout so i'm gonna see if i can get some of that recorded for you guys and uh post commentary because it's been a long time so um i just want to welcome you to the video and i hope y'all enjoyed the rest of the video and I'll catch y'all in the next clip. What's going on y'all? So I'm currently, as you can see, in my car still after the workout. So I thought I might as well go ahead and do um, the commentary. And I wanted to bring back this uh, physical type of commentary where you can actually see me at the bottom of your screen and you're watching the workout on the, above me. So welcome to this commentary and it feels good to be back and I'm ready to bring y'all what I'm bringing in the next nine and a half weeks today is thursday 5 39 a.m so let's go ahead and get into this workout so i'm gonna pull up the workout on my phone just to make sure i don't mess up so the way i recorded this was to kind of show my grips here so when i train back um key things are uh to use my hands as hooks okay i'm never doing this with my thumbs because i'm putting my thumbs over as hooks so basically uh every uh pulling movement i'm hooking my hands like that and i'm pulling with my elbows not so much with my biceps so every movement say like the first movement you see is a t-bar row i did four sets of eight i have hooks over i even showed the beginning of the movement you can go back to the um rewind it a bit and then i'm literally pulling like that so that's key thing there make sure to get a squeeze leave your ego at the door please like it's not about heavy weight it is about progressive overload and uh adding weight throughout time but please do not focus on heavy weight and pulling with your neck and stuff like that because those are those are cheating reps and those do not count unless you have scheduled partial reps those are different but moving on um we had seven sets of eight on wide grip lat pull down same thing here you can see on my thumb if you go back in the video it's it's over and i'm pulling with my elbows have a slight lean here get the full contraction protract retract everything get it done uh, don't pull in front of you make sure your elbow straight down and you're pulling back it's hard to explain keep watching it and then we went down to do four sets of eight on seated cable row with the straight bar so here same thing pulling with the grip the key thing here is grips grips it's hooks I'm hooking it here and then here I'm not stretching all the way out and then bring it back in cut slow and controlled slow and controlled and feeling that squeeze swallowing your spine with your shoulder blades Keep that visual in mind when you're doing that. Okay, and we uh, finished out back with five sets of seven on face pulls. Uh, the visual here is you're grabbing it like this and you're uh, imitating a back double bicep and you're pulling the rope into your face. It's gonna like be super close to your face like that and you're getting a squeeze. This is not a momentum movement. You have to control the weight on here to feel it on your traps. So you're pulling like that and then you're going. All right, moving on to biceps. We did four sets of eight on standing dumbbell hammer curls. On here, this is not a, a movement, uh, not a movement, a momentum movement as well. Slow and controlled squeeze at the top. A lot of people like to um, uh, surpass full range of motion by swinging to try to get high to their shoulders. That's surpassing full range. Don't do that. Just come up and then if you're, if you're, um, if your elbow starts to move up then you've you've gone past full range motion that's when you need to know that you need to stop all right moving on preach curl with straight bar same thing here uh, you're sitting down on the preach curl uh don't you don't have to bring it up to your face okay as long as you know you've hit full range motion you're good you don't have to like let your elbow rise up from the pad okay squeeze 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 leave your ego at the door okay and we closed out these are new for me four sets of eight on plate bicep curls um these are 
have been a little tricky for me, but they give me a very good pump and it's a very uh, good alternative for just normal bicep curls. I'm pretty sure some, not a lot of people do these, but I feel like I'm blabbering and it's been four minutes. So uh, I just want to thank y'all for staying in this video and I hope you like this, um, this little uh, version of the commentary. So I hope you enjoy the rest of this video. I'm going to take you throughout the day. Welcome back to the vlogs. I love you. Thank you for the support. I'll catch you in the next commentary. All right, what's going on, y'all? Back in my kitchen. Uh, I'm going to show y'all my health shake. Uh, I started incorporating this week uh, because I was feeling, real talk, constipated. And I felt like that was holding me back a lot. So, um, let me see if you got any natural sunlight. Mm -hmm. All right, so I'm gonna show you every ingredient that I'm using my health shake and it literally kept me full all day. I ate breakfast at nine and I didn't eat my second meal until 3 p.m. That's how full I was. So it's all about the volume. So stay tuned and I'm gonna show you what I got. All right, key ingredients here. Do not forget your micros, okay? Uh, your micronutrients are important and they have volume, okay? So we got strawberries. Spinach is a major key right here. This helps me um, digest my food better and keeps me full longer. And I have some uh, vanilla Greek yogurt. And this is a great value brand. Do not sleep on great value. It's about like a dollar or two cheaper than regular and it tastes exactly the same and it's just going in a shake. Here I got some milk as well. I know it has uh, carbs and sugar, but you know, it's fine. And then we got single banana. We got some sweetener packets. And we got some vanilla uh, protein from my protein. The reason it's in a uh, gallon size Ziploc bag is because me and some friends me and three of my clients actually, uh, we purchased 22 pounds and then we divided by four. So we saved a lot of money doing it that way. Um, and we each got five and a half pounds for about like 28 bucks. So keep in mind, cause my protein always has that deal where you can buy in bulk. So we did that and we just split it up, saved a lot of money. So I'm gonna go ahead and make this and then I'll show you what I got. All right, breakfast is all cooked up. I'm gonna show you what I got for breakfast. Here's what we got. We got four egg whites, two whole eggs, two slices of turkey, spinach, volume. We got a flaxseed high fiber tortilla. Then we got a uh, Thomas muffin, the oatmeal cinnamon, double protein with some strawberry jam. I'm gonna sprinkle some cinnamon on there. And then we got my health shake. This is half of it. I'm gonna save the other half for later. And some Valentina sauce. And I kid you not, this whole meal, this whole meal, the macros are a hundred and hold on 10 116 protein 98 carb 12 fiber and 18 fat just for one meal eat big get big just kidding but um yeah so uh today's my refeed actually so and today's my anniversary uh with my uh, fiance happy anniversary or month anniversary and we're going to Razoo. She's never tried oysters, so we're gonna go eat oysters. But I'm gonna end the video soon, so I'll catch you in the next clip. It's our anniversary. It's my refeed. We're here. Oh my god. I haven't been out to eat in like a month. More than a month. Look how shiny that is. Oh my god. They hooked it up on this refeed. She's about to try oysters for the first time. He didn't time. get me anything. Took a glimmer. Your boy. Your boy on a budget, that's why. <laughs> Her oysters are here. Her first time. She said it looks funny. <laughs> Carson, say subscribe. Subscribe. <laughs>